Good evening. It's been more than two decades since four-year-old Michael Dunahy vanished from a Victoria playground. Over the years, the unsolved case has generated countless tips, but the right one has yet to surface. As Kylie Stanton explains, the family isn't giving up hope. Today, they're releasing a new composite sketch in an effort to bring their son home. Uh, he's probably two. Two here, I guess, yeah. He's helping Grandma bake. Flipping through family photos taken more than 20 years ago. He liked camping. He liked going fishing with his grandfather. Images of a happy young boy learning to skate and yeah, sitting on Santa's on knee. They're the memories these parents have of their son before he disappeared from a Victoria playground. To us, it still seems like it was yesterday that it happened, and we just take each day as it comes. It doesn't really seem like 21 years have passed. It was March 24, 1991. As Michael Dunahy's parents were preparing for a game of football at Blanchard Elementary, the four-year-old went to play here at the nearby playground. Within minutes, he had vanished without a trace. We just want Michael to come home. Can. The disappearance launched one of the largest police investigations in Canadian history. Officers scoured the area from bushes to back alleys, even going door to door. Having a search for a lost child in the area. All of it captured by the media. Must have been a hundred, couple of hundred people here that day. Now revisiting the site where the mystery began brings everything back. Still, that one of those great unsolved mysteries that uh, you can't, I can't drive by here without thinking of the, of, of that day and uh, the weeks and months and years that have gone by with no resolution. Always surprises those of us that were involved that he wasn't found. No tip, no matter how far fetched, was ignored. These stories are what helped make Michael Dunahy a household name and his picture recognizable. A new composite sketch for every milestone, 10 and 15 years since his disappearance. And here's the latest, Michael now at 26 years old. Something new for people to look at as a reminder that we're not looking for a four-year-old anymore. We're looking for a man now. Long grown up since this home video was taken, or pictures were framed, reminders that help the family get through each year. There's always hope that uh, even after this length of time that Michael could would still come home. The case is active with new tips still coming in. Until the right one surfaces, the Dunahees are holding on to that hope and each other. <laughs>